lots of red tape uh, that it seems to me are, are, uh, creates too much duplication. And so I even asked the question, well, do, do the bureaucrats in D.C. not trust the bureaucrats in Milwaukee? They don't trust the bureaucrats in, in Green Bay. What, what's going on? Um, why is it all these layers of approval? Because there's so many of them. And I think it's in part that they want to be doubly sure that the patient cares exactly the best that they can deliver. And uh, so that's kind of what they're, they're, they're viewing on. And they are very pa patient-centric. I also asked about the issue of overtime. You know, they want to get a response. And so they're contacting our office and saying, you know, this is taking so long. I've had yeah. to wait four months, six months, eight months. Could you look into this for me? And they're so talking I, about waits here? In both here and in Milwaukee. Okay. And so, however, I would tell you that I do have veterans that, that contact my office and say, listen, I, I know there's been a lot of problems that I'm hearing about in the news. That's not been my experience here in Green yeah, Bay okay, or Appleton or Milwaukee. My experience has been good with the VA, and I, I, I want to make sure that, that I, I present a balanced uh, conversation about this as I possibly can. Um, but if your loved one's a veteran and they can't hear because they haven't been able to get a hearing aid, uh, their dentures aren't fitting correctly, or they're waiting months for uh, urology or some type of treatment, that's a real problem, in particular if that's your loved one. And uh, we also hear a fair amount on the PTSD side that psychiatric care is taking too long. Here in Green Bay. Uh, here and in Milwaukee.